बी रेडी टेन सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट सर आई एम ग्लैड आवर फाइनेंस मिनिस्टर इज हियर अकॉर्डिंग टू हिज नथिंग इज राइजिंग वेरी मच आफ्टर द बजट ओनली मार्जिनली हियर एंड देअर सर्टेन आइटम्स हैव बीन अफेक्टेड द आइटम्स ऑन विच ही हैज कट टैक्सेस इन हिज बजट आर एब्सोल्यूटली फ्री फ्रॉम द प्राइस राइज सर आई हैड अ बेटर ओपिनियन ऑफ ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर आई हैव नोन हिम फॉर मैनी ईयर्स एंड ही इज अ नॉलेजेबल पर्सन ऑल आई से इज दैट द बजट हैज अ नेगेटिव इम्पैक्ट ऑन द प्राइसिस दैट इज टू से इट इज पुशिंग अप द प्राइसिस इर रिस्पेक्टिव ऑफ वेदर अ पर्टिकुलर आइटम हैज रजिस्टर्ड अ हायर प्राइस और अ लोअर प्राइस द ट्रेंड इज वन ऑफ ग्रोइंग इन्फ्लेशन एस्केलेटिंग इन्फ्लेशन नाउ सर इन द लास्ट फाइनेंशियल ईयर अकॉर्डिंग टू द होल सेल प्राइस इंडेक्स इन्फ्लेशन वॉज ट्वेंटी परसेंट इट अपीयर्स फ्रॉम वॉट एवर मटीरियल वी हैव कलेक्टेड फ्रॉम various sources including his sources that this year inflation is likely to be at the rate of 30% during the first few weeks of his, this calendar year the prices rose by 32.7% in the post budget period the prices jumped up by 12.2% in the post presentation of the budget our calculation is on the basis of the material that we get from the government and other sources that it has increased by more than 5% this is since the presentation of the budget in june last now sir this is the position here sir i must point out that the middle class is particularly hard hit according to the studies that we have made on an average a middle class man has to spend rupees 55 to rupees 60 per month more than what he was spending immediately before the budget to maintain the pre budget standard of living now these are gathered from the economic data and many papers have also written on this subject not sir what i find is that the essential commodities commodities of common consumption are constantly registering rise in their prices which hit the common man this is one of the most disturbing features in the present inflation but so far no step has been taken 
one of your election slogans was that you would hold the prize line but exactly the opposite you have done exactly the opposite is happening here the prize is unprecedented now except for one year during the whole of the last two decades this inflation is unprecedented and it is at an unprecedented rate this is a strange thing now sir i need not go into sugar and other things but i will give my suggestions middle class people particularly and all the other sections are hit at the same time but paradoxically sir the just growers and the farmers are losing the jute prices have collapsed and you can understand what will happen to them now you have given here the export duty on turmeric the prices have collapsed and you have put rupees 2 per kg or so as export duty or rupees 200 or so per quintal that you should have avoided what is now needed is that physical possession of the essential commodities should be there how do you do that it has been stated very clearly and earlier also i repeat that without physical possession you cannot ensure supplies without physical possession how can you ensure supplies and that can be done by two ways first by nationalizing certain essential commodities why textiles should not be nationalized why sugar should not be nationalized why can't these be nationalized so that you can have physical possession sir the standard cloth production has gone down and the super fine and finer varieties of cloth have been produced to make super profits by the big mill owners this is number 1 then secondly commander all the stocks from such industries in order to distribute them these are the two essential things sugar and textiles should be nationalized nationalization should take place but they will not do that then sir deficit financing is there you have to curb deficit financing you have said that deficit financing would be of the order of rupees 1400 crores it never happens i think deficit financing would be well over rupees 2500 crores then distribution through fair price shops it is a myth now we had been hearing that within 6 months it would have been done but nothing has been done during the entire janta rule today vigorous efforts should be made to improve the distribution system that has become a myth the number needed 
is more in the villages and in the towns popular committees should be attached to the distribution centers or shops that is very very important money supply should be checked these are the causes which have given rise to price rise distribution expenditure by the government must be cut i gave you one example i can give you many examples also stop